Hey everyone, I'm Amanda, and today we're gonna go over how to interpret bar graphs. So these are just some helpful how-to tips on how to do it. So when you have a bar graph, it looks something like this. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna look at the x-axis, which is on the bottom, and you're gonna see what objects and variables are being used. Then you're gonna look at the y-axis, which is over here, and you're gonna see the number of each variable that's present. So I have some practice problems to make this a little easier to explain. And so we're gonna go through each of them. So Myra went grocery shopping and bought some melons, kiwis, and apples. She made a bar graph of the fruit she bought. So here we have the bar graph. On the x-axis, we have the fruits, which are the objects. And on the y-axis, we have the number, which is how many she bought. So the question is asking how many melons did she buy? So using this key here, we see that this is what the melons look like. It's a watermelon. So we go to the X axis, we find melons, and then we're gonna go up the bar until it stops. And it stops right here, which is at seven. So the correct answer is that according to the bar graph, she bought seven melons. So let's keep working through some examples. Luca went into the family garage and saw some ladders and a pair of scissors. He made a bar graph of the items he saw. So here we have ladder and scissors. This is, remember, this is the x-axis and this is the y-axis. So how many pairs of scissors did he see? We locate the object on the x-axis and then we go up the bar until it stops. And then we look to the left and it stopped at eight. Therefore, he bought eight pairs of scissors. Brenna went outside to play and found 15 friends, all of whom had brought a bat. She made a bar graph showing the different balls they had to play with. So here's the x-axis. We see the objects, which are the balls, and the y-axis, how many? So how many people brought baseballs? We know from here that this is the baseball. So we're gonna go up the graph until it stops, and then we'll look to the left. Stopped at four. So we know that four people brought baseballs. Here's the next one. Frank decided to give some clothes to charity and donate some coats, belts, and pairs of shorts. He made a bar graph of the donation. How many coats did he donate? So we're gonna go to the X axis. We see coats right here. We're gonna go up the bar until it stops. And we go to the left to see the number on the y-axis and we see that it's seven. So he donated seven coats. Linda went to the snack bar and saw some ice cream cones, hot dogs, and pretzels. She made a bar graph of the items she saw. How many pretzels did she see? So again, we go to the x-axis we find the object, we go up the bar graph until it stops, and we go to the left to see what number it is. She only brought one pretzel. Julia went to a petting zoo and saw some donkeys, goats, roosters, and ferrets. She made a bar graph of the animals she saw. How many roosters did she see? We can tell from here, this is the rooster. This is the x-axis, located the object. We're gonna go up the graph until it stops, look to the left, and we see nine. Therefore, she saw nine roosters. We just have a couple more. Ken looked in the backyard shed and found some lawnmowers, rakes, garbage cans, and shovels. He made a bar graph. How many shovels did he find? This right here is the shovels up the bar until it ends. Then we look to the left and we see six. Therefore, he found six shovels. Deb asked her friends to vote for their favorite vegetable. She made a bar graph showing how many people named each vegetable. How many people voted for lettuce as their favorite? Here's lettuce. We go up until it stops go to the left and we see three people. Three people voted for lettuce as their favorite vegetable. 
These are the last two. Robert went to the snack bar and saw some pretzels, chocolate chip cookies, and slices of pie. He made a bar graph of the items he saw. How many pretzels did he see? Here's pretzels. I'm gonna go up the bar to the left. We see six, which means he bought six pretzels. Here's the very last one. Shane looked for a snack in the kitchen and found some apples, oranges, and pretzels. He made a bar graph of the snacks he found. How many pretzels did he find? Here's pretzels. We go up the bar until it stops. Look to the left and we see two. He found two pretzels. Okay, everyone, that's all the questions that I have to go over with you guys today. And I hope that was helpful. So thank you.